guys how you're doing today is saturday and i'm actually supposed to be in church right now because we have um children's day we have children's day party tomorrow and i'm the dance teacher for the kids so we need to do like the last rehearsal before tomorrow however you know we've been doing like um travel vlog lately of our vacation we've been doing um and you guys you guys know we've been doing like um vacation vlog there's this bed here looking at me and i can see like eyeball to eyeball <laughs> anyway guys you know i've been doing like a series with you guys regarding our upcoming vacation by the time you see this it's either we're already there or we're back <laughs> anyways i wanted to show you guys some of the things i got some of the items that the last set of items because the guys have been shopping i don't even want to tell you like i've been shopping right i've shopped and shopped and shopped and right now my account balance is like it's looking at me like i bought i bought so i had to order some dresses because like i said i don't know if i mentioned my husband's birthday like i strategically planned this vacation in a way that i would fall into my husband's birthday so the plan for the birthday is that we're gonna have like dinner okay but aside that i realized that i don't have a lot of dresses like flay dresses in my wardrobe and i decided to buy some and i'm just going to unbox it briefly with you guys before i run off because it's already past 10 and i need to be there so i'll just show you guys um i'll just show you guys some of the items so as you can see i don't know i, li I like to shop from i don't know i like to shop from shame because quite alright they are affordable but i'm i i realize that their texture like their fabric textures are beginning to like they're beginning to make more sense compared to when i used to shop from them two years or you know last year it now makes sense so yeah the affordability part is there i would not deny that fact because obviously i don't i don't like to break the bank to look beautiful but then again their texture is i mean it sells me all the time and that's why i always shop from them i don't have patience to open one one so i'm just gonna show you guys I got a couple of dresses and i'm even just seeing it for the first time so <laughs> this is also going to be like me reviewing the dresses as well guys look at this one yay i love this dress i love love it it looks exactly like what i saw on their on their website on the app and i'm impressed guys i'll drop this one here I'm just going to try and make this video. I don't want this. I don't want this vlog to be long. I don't want it to be long because we're going to churches. But oh my god, this one! What is this? Okay, okay, this is like a wrap-on dress. I can't try it on on my outfit, so I'll just show you guys. This is like a wrap-on dress, and I decided to buy black because I also realized that I don't have any black dress. Okay, I have a black dress, but I don't have any black flay dress. <laughs> Ah. anyways um this one as well i ordered this one because i love the color guys i love the color so much I, I don't think i have something like this in my wardrobe i don't think i do and that's why i decided to get one of these ah guys you're gonna see me when i rock this dress i'm gonna choose one of them for the dinner and I would have said you guys should choose for me, but by the time you're seeing this video, I would the dinner would probably be over. We would have been long past that stage of our lives. <laughs> anyway, I love this dress. I love all of them because they're like, oh my god, let me even talk about I forgot, let me even talk about the texture of this dress. Oh my god, this is satin, silk satin. Guys, being a fashion designer myself, I trust me, I know when I say the fabric is conducive, like it's so lush on the skin. I love this fabric, guys. I do. My baby is crying. Can you hear her voice? I need to hurry up. I need to hurry up. Hurry, 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 hurry. Look at this one as well. <laughs> oh my god. I would have tried it on, but now nah, I don't have that time right now. But guys, tell me what you think. Tell me, tell me what you think. Tell me, tell me what you think. I'm so excited. <laughs> and I was very intentional about the colors that i bought like i looked through my wardrobe and realized that there are some colors i was lacking and by colors i mean 
like red colors like you see burnt orange like this one you see that this one is a burnt orange you see that i don't have a burnt orange in my wardrobe and i was very intentional about getting a color i don't have and then also looking through my my shoes and my purses i made sure to look for dresses that i know i because i don't want to buy any new shoes so dresses i know that i can accessorize comfortably without having to go back and get shoes guys this color sold it again for me the fabric oh my god the fabric the texture the texture is silk DJ is crying. DJ is silk. I love, love, love it. But guys, you know green is my favorite color, right? But this particular green, this lemon green, I don't have any lemon green in my wardrobe. And I thought to just give it a try. I'm sold. I'm sold. Everything is selling me. <laughs> it's easy to sell me. So, guys, I think we're almost done. Okay. Then this one. I think they, they were like seven in total. And they were all dresses except for one. I just got it all because I didn't have that color and then this one I had to get this color because I don't know I don't even know why I bought this dress but I think I like the color I've not worn it I don't know what it's gonna look like but and I feel most of these dresses will be big on me so at the end of the day I might even have to like adjust all of them to my size but I love that it's between like a size 10 and size 12 so when I feel like I'm putting on weight I can still wear when I feel like I'm losing weight I can just stitch it on and you know get it on my sides but I love it guys I love that the hand is also elastic so you can like roll it up and roll it down however you please so it's a beautiful one for me the last one is the last one is this top I got I got this top of shame shame obviously you can see it's shame but it's Shane Vakay. I love this top so much, guys. The hand, the sleeve, the sleeve. You might probably see it on me for the vacation. I'm not sure yet, but yeah. I think it was just the sleeve. This whole um, deliberate printed tot that caught my eye. But yeah, I love it. I also wanted to show you guys the gifts we got from our marriage parents and Diche's godparents. The same people who are our marriage parents are also Diche's godparents. They came to visit us last week Sunday and they got gifts for us, guys. I'll show you. Give me one minute. So, guys, look at our Christmas gifts. Can you believe that? You know, if you've watched my previous vlog when I was doing like my perfume haul, you would know that I was very emphatic about the Latafa the Latifa series for like the perfume, the Arab perfume, Eastern Arab perfumes, guys. I'm very big on it. When she gifted me this, when she gifted us, actually, because this one is for me, this one is for my husband. So, and this one is for my husband, but both of them are Latafa, guys. I'm going to unbox it here because I've been wanting to. In fact, I was tempted to unbox it that day, but I was like, I'll show you guys because I have never seen this tag before. I have never seen this, um, this, this collection rather i've never seen this one before so i'm very excited to even see what it looks like and then what it smells like oh my gosh i'm excited guys i'm excited i'm excited i'm thrilled oh my god how is that okay look at the packaging let me start with the packaging guys look at can you see can you see <laughs> can you see this is Assad. you know the one i the last one i the, the one i um reviewed for you guys was Aswad, and this one is Assad. <laughs> A few no will finish me. She was so oh my god, guys. This perfume. Oh my god, I've seen this I've seen this perfume time and time again. God, the reviews are mad. Guys, look at can you see? Ah I'll be the first person to spray. My husband will be like, You're launching my perfume. Ah <sighs> I don't even want to talk so much. I don't want this video to be long. But guys, it smells masculine. <laughs> ah, oh my god, it smells masculine. This is you look at even the ingredients. Oh my god, this is amazing. I love, love, love it. Oh my god. Ah, ah, oh my god. The perfume is look at I've seen this. I've seen the pink one as well. If you look at this Assad Latafa. You know that like they have different ones. I've seen the pink one, but I did not know there was a black. And this black is obviously for men because our marriage parents said um this is for my husband, so obviously it's for men. Guys, yeah, it smells it smells heavenly. Heavenly. Oh my god, I'm so excited for him. And to think I was to think I was looking for something to give my husband for birthday gifts this year. I mean, aside his vacation, which is a gift to him, I was hoping to get like something else. 
now. It will be hard because I can't buy perfume again. I have to buy something else. I don't know. Yeah, I think my own. I am excited. I am excited. Can you see the packaging? This is Latafa, but this is Latafa Pride. <laughs> Guys, this is Latafa Pride. <laughs> huh, I'm always so hot about perfumes. This is Latafa Pride. Can you see? I don't even know if you guys can see it. Should I go back? I don't know if you can see my camera. But can you see it? Ha! Boy, look at the package. Are you seeing? Let me just show you how I open it. There's a pull off here, so you just pull it out. Okay. Ah, my baby got on for. Oh my god, it even has like. Oh my god, it even has like the different collections. Look at guys, it has like the different collections where they show you like the different other types just in case you're interested. Oh my god. I think Latafa has so so many varieties, guys. All these things are their varieties. I don't know if you can see it. All these things are their varieties. Can you see? Guys, I'm so thrilled. Like, like I'm sold. Latafa don't sell, they don't sell me. Oh my god, look at mine. Guys. I'm so excited. Oh my god. This has to be like one of the best Christmas gifts ever. I have never received a perfume as a Christmas gift before. I don't think I have. This one, this one, this one. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> I can smell amber, rose hood. Alba, rosewood, a touch of oud. What else? What else? What else? Mount vanilla. Ah! <laughs> oh my god, I'm so excited. Guys, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'm so happy. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I am so happy. This has got to be one of the most intentional Christmas gifts I've gotten. No cap, no cap, guys. This has got to be one of the most intentional. I, uh, let me put my this thing because this thing now will make me. I'm looking for that one to buy. That's if I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you, <laughs> guys. I'm so excited. Ah, I didn't even know I was going to do like a perfume unboxing in this vlog because I just wanted to show you guys, but then I saw that it was Latafa, and then I was like, oh, I have to unbox it because I want you guys to see. If you are not a fan of Arab perfume, Eastern Arab perfumes, guys, are you even perfuming? Like, are you even are you even a perfume lover? <laughs> God. I'm so excited. Don't mind me. I'm always so happy when I see perfumes. I'm so sorry. But now it's time to go to church because I'm already late. I'm gonna catch you guys on the other end. I think the next vlog I'll do will be the packing. Where we'll be packing our boxes and I'll show you guys. I'll definitely show you guys the things I'll be coming with. Just so because we're all going on this vacation. Sure, you know, all of us are going to be on this vacation. So you need to, you know, see how things are done. <laughs> Woo! This is my excitement dance. Guys, I need to get ready. So this is the sh this is my slippers. This is what I'll be wearing. Um, I got this one recently as well. It was supposed to be for the vacation as well, but wearing it. And this, my handbag, and then my perfume. Hold on. I was going to launch this one, but I'm not going to launch it yet. <laughs> oh my god! I'm going to be using my musuf. This is, um, it's not as wide, but this is also an Arab perfume. This one. This one I'm going to be spraying today. So. Uh, let's go! Catch you guys. Bye. <laughs>
oranges. Thank you. There you go. And can you go straight to the car park for me and I can bring it out to you. All right, thank you. Thank you so much. All right, thank you. How's your day going? I'm currently at KFC right now. I came to buy I came to buy lunch because I didn't cook anything today and I was just thinking to myself as the mother end of the house you have to think of where everyone's going to eat right so I thought about it I didn't have anything I have sweet potato chips I have yeah I have sweet potato chips right now so I was like let me drive through KFC and get chicken for dinner so maybe potato and chicken something like that anyway i'm just waiting for my order because they didn't have the spicy one i don't like the original the original just it's not spicy for me so i usually order the spices so they had to like do it afresh for me and i requested for extra spicy because i like pepper <laughs> anyway i'm just waiting for it to come through right now and i'll drive home i have a lot to do today i slept last night i slept around 2 a.m actually 3 a.m this morning i went to bed around 3 a.m this morning and i woke up around 9 a.m guys i mean i feel like i'm just indirectly shooting myself on the leg because i shouldn't be going to bed late because i mean i have a lot to do so that i mean even with that i couldn't do my exercise this morning because we had to rush off to her daycare anyways i'm just waiting for i'm just waiting for that to come through and then we'll head home I just thought to holla at you guys and know how you're doing ignore my tired face i woke up from i won't say the wrong side of the bed but i woke up from the tired side of my bed so it is what it is so while we're waiting on while we're waiting on my KFC to come through i know i've done a lot of talking in this vlog but i just wanted to put this out there so something happened recently let me just you guys and i, I need your opinion okay so something happened recently a friend of a friend of mine was doing her birthday and someone wished her happy birthday on social media was saying happy birthday my love you know happy birthday this you know using endearing words so it's woman to woman right so and then she came and said oh that her husband we're just having a conversation in the past and she's like her husband said oh that she that she that he she shouldn't be using endearing words for women that endearing words should be for her husband actually i do understand where that is coming from because men don't use endearing words to themselves so you see a man wishing his fellow man happy birthday you see things like happy birthday brother or happy birthday my guy you know that kind of thing and then for we women we'll be like happy birthday my love happy birthday my darling you know all those things so um when she talked about it like i said she said it's in a passing but i couldn't help but think about it because I noticed that we women we know how to use endearing words for for people personally i like to say nay i like to call my like my fellow women nay dear sis you know even though i feel like the word sis is becoming abused these days because you call everyone sis even though they're not supposed to be called sis but yeah you get what i mean so what what what's your thought what do you think about it do you think it is appropriate i think that's the that's the right word you think it's appropriate for women to address their fellow women with sweet endearing words like my love my darling you know things like that i have a lot of people who call me that and i do not find anything wrong or offensive with that i do not even feel like i'm special so to say because a lot of people just that's how they are right but what do you think because i couldn't help but think about it like I was just asking myself in my head so in your head what's your husband thinking that you're sharing his love with somebody else or that you feel like that love that word love is for him and him alone so you shouldn't use it for someone else i was just thinking about it i'm like i want to hear your opinion especially for ladies i mean of course i have i know i have male subscribers as well tell me what your thoughts are why are you popping your head <laughs> tell me what your thoughts are because i was just thinking about it and i'm like hmm 
this is something to deliberate on let me know what your viewpoint is to be honest let me know what your viewpoint let me know what you think if you actually and let me know what you think and how you address your female friends you know do you call them dear my my you know my babe or babe even that word babe <laughs> guys i don't want to scatter this table <laughs> even that word babe because i know that a lot of couples call themselves babe babe and personally i know this may even sound somehow but personally i can i don't call my husband babe i don't like it for anything i don't even there was even one day he basically called me babe and i'm like can't be can't be do when did this start which one where choice is babe you know i don't like it i don't like being called babe i don't like calling my partner babe because i feel like that's what i call my female friends okay so i'm chatting my friends with babe you know that's how i address my female friends so i feel like i cannot address my husband as babe because that's literally how i address my female friends this now goes back to what i was talking about when you when you call your fr your female friends love because probably you saved your husband's name as love or you call him my love you know things like that and you know it's just a bit i'm just thinking about it right now like my own personally i like to call them anything that comes to my mind depending on how i feel if i feel up in the mood or i feel like this person is actually close to my heart or has done so much for me or is an important part of my life i can say happy birthday love you know things like that but to men guys if if you're a man on this my channel please let me know if i'm correct or if i'm just bluffing but men don't see it the way we see it because we feel like we women we're more endearing than men we're more emotional so to say that men okay so let me know what your thoughts are i'm thinking about this louder i'm putting this out there because i want to know if it's just me in my head thinking the way i'm thinking or if it's a thing okay if it's a thing a lot of people like i said a lot of people call their husbands babe and it's okay because i have friends that call their that call me babe and call their husbands babe okay it's not a problem but i'm just saying what is your opinion about it what do you think do you think it's a norm do you think it's a 21st century thing do you think it's a gen z thing or a millennial thing because i don't even know right now but let me know what your thoughts are because i'm just here thinking to myself joe are you all right is your brain paining you you know or maybe you're thinking from the left side of your brain <laughs> guys i beg i've talked too much in this vlog i think i'm waiting for them to i'm waiting for them once my kfc comes thank you so much thank you thank you thank you so guys my kfc is finally here and it's time to go home thank you guys don't forget what i said i want to hear your comments okay thank you for sticking with me throughout this vlog <laughs> if this is your first time you're welcome 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 ignore my baby's voice in the background she's here what do you expect anyway thank you for sticking with me thank you thank you thank you thank you for stopping by if this is your first time that's what we did do for you this is our family this is our community thank you my daughter thank you so much if you are a subscriber if you're a member of the family thank you for sticking around guys and until next time bye